Hi everyone and welcome to the Learning Ladder. I'm really excited today to show you my new range of products for the Learning Ladder store. So these are all available via Amazon, physical products that you can order and have shipped to you wherever you live, in theory, because it's Amazon's pretty much worldwide. So hopefully if you are interested, you should be able to get them. So the first one I'm going to show you is journal through time <laughs> so this is my history um journal and if you saw my journey through time curriculum uh lesson plans and it's similar in terms of all the notebooks are in here i did it slightly have to adapt it though obviously to make it a book format but it goes through all the same time periods that i um, showed you previously so from stone age to victorians romans ancient times um vikings everything and um it's all in a journal format so they can journal away i'm really excited i'll give you um, a flip through of it um in an upcoming video i did actually make it in color um so that does make it slightly more expensive but i would i'm not opposed to putting it in black and white i just thought some of the pictures are really nice so it's just in the shame to put them into into black and white but if like the feedback i get is that you're more than happy to have it in black and white then i can definitely change it and offer a black and white version as well. I just really liked, um, I'm just trying to get a colour picture to show you, I just really like the fact that it could be in colour. Um, so there. But it is so exciting, so that's a journal through time. There we go, front and back. And um, it goes through, as I said, all the periods of history, there's copy work in here, there's different activities um, that they can do, uh, the STEM activities, um, you know, lots of language arts things, designing different projects, um, it's just so much. So I'll definitely give you a flip through, that'll probably be the first video that I do after this one, so that's journal through time. Okay, the next thing I'm going to show you, let me think, yeah, probably this one is homeschool planners. <laughs> so I have got four different versions, two in colour and two in black and white. The only difference between them is the cover everything is the same inside so this is the the interior so as you can see it's sort of a material uh, design which is really cool and then if you notice on the back of pretty much most of them you'll see now it's got create and that's because that's my word of the year <laughs> so it seems appropriate to put it on the back of the book so if you're thinking where she got that on the back that's why um so this as i said is the color version so this is your pattern inside this is obviously the name page where you can write your name at the top um this is your calendar spread I'll, I'll, I'll give you a flip through of this one so this as i said is the color one i do have uh, three other designs and i'll give you a quick peek at the covers in a second of the other designs but i'll do a flip through of this soon it's a nice hefty uh planner so i'm really excited about that one and then if you're anything like me and yes you love planners but you also need something to write in i made notebooks <laughs> so this one pretty much goes really well with that cover because of the design i do have um five other options for notebooks um so two of them go with the color planner in theory two of them go with the neutral planner and then one of them is just a, a, a different design um, to make it fun so a quick peek inside this one so you've got your main page and then this one is lined and you've got some little designs at the top and it's lined all the way through and I have included in all of them a pen test page because I know what it's like when you've got markers and you want to know do they go through or not so I thought I'd add that in so that's the notebook then for let me I'll do all the mum stuff first for you mums as well and then I'll show you the rest of the kids stuff I have got meal planners <laughs> i'm really excited for this as well especially because i am really into meal planning at the moment it helps budgeting it helps you use up what you've got it helps you to be more organized and everything else and um i just love meal planning so i have got two different designs in this one interior is the same just the cover cover is different and as i said i will flip through um this one in a future video for you as well so that's my meal planner the next thing I have got is all the things, two versions of this one, interior is the same, just different cover, and this is to-do lists. So 
this if you see this design here that's actually the neutral design for the homeschool planner i i really like this because if you want to you can color in the flowers so although it's a neutral theme throughout the homeschool planner you can actually color it in and add some more color if you want to so that's the same design for the neutral planner but this is your lib uh, to-do list box so we've got uh, priority so you can obviously number them if you want to and then tick when done and it's just a big long book of to-do lists so that's that one okay more kids stuff we have got draw your own comic book um, so there are two different designs for this one as well um, and it's basically just lots of different panels for them to make their own comic books my daughter absolutely loves making comic books um, so if your kid is like anything like mine then they will really appreciate this one so that's that one then we've also got i've got tons of different designs in this one and i'll show you them in a minute my notebook um, so this is the butterfly one and basically it's a composition style so you've got um a place to draw uh write write and then obviously because uh, our children are getting older now another place to write and then a comic book template so it's, it's a different template each time so you've got your draw you've got your write another write and then a comic book template and i thought it just made it made a difference to you know your bog standard composition notebook adding the template in because i know my daughter really loves doing that and obviously say they're writing about I don't know, a life cycle of something uh, say you say you use this as a signed book um then they can do a comic section of all the things that they learn about it um, after they've finished making their notes you could use it for copy work um, so they could do their copy work and then draw a picture and then um, you, know, you could make a story about it in the comic book template of their copy work or wh whatever it is there's so many different options for these I just love them so again there are lots of designs for that one which I'll show you in a second and then the last one I've got to show you today is um, my spelling book now i was going to do this with a template design where you know you could list all your spelling words and everything else but i decided not to do that and i decided to leave it free form so then you can use it with any curriculum there's not going to be oh it only covers 15 spelling words or whatever and i did it in a notebook style so basically they can do their spelling words and then they can do their dictation um you know on the opposite page so that's why i decided this one is a pokemon themed one this one is in color um and i do have three other designs so i have a sort of a neutral pokemon one and then i have a horse one um, anyway i'll show you them in a second so that's the spelling one okay so i just thought i'd show you um the right way around because the camera on this new phone reverses everything when it's it's filmed the other way around my other one doesn't which is super annoying but anyway this one does but they are not backwards so here's the homeschool planner front and back um here is journal through time Um, this is the spelling book, um, my notebook, now this is the draw your own comic book, um, this is the to-do list one, um, this is the meal planner, and this is a chunky one as well, meal planner, and then this is the notepad. Okay, so I'm just going to show you these on Amazon UK because it's easier, but there are they are on Amazon.com as well. So there's the horse design for the spelling book. So there's your front. There's another notebook design. Um, these are all your composition notebook styles that I showed you with the writing space to draw and then the comic book template. There's a rainbow one. This is the alternate cover for the alternative cover for the meal planner. There's another notebook one. Another notebook one, just a darker colour. This is one of the neutral homeschool planner covers. There's another notebook. It's Owl. This is the spelling book, so, so the neutral cover for the Pokemon. This is not in colour internally. Um, it does still have the same designs with the Pokeballs, and um, but they're in black and white rather than in colour. Here's the composition notebook for the neutral one. I've got the Bugs. A wolf. This one is the composition notebook. And another one, just a different colour. There's the notebook for you, for the mum. Uh, that goes with the homeschool planner, the neutral. 
This is the cover for the other version of the um, colourful interior, just a different cover of the homeschool planner. And then that's the other neutral homeschool planner. And there's the other design for the comic book. I actually flipped them around, so as the um, pencil one on the front for the other one, this has got the pencils on the back, and then the one that had the pencils on the front had this on the back. So I just flipped them around to make a different version, just so you've got more options. Okay, and I've got three more designs. They are just in review at the moment. They should be live in the next couple of days. Um, so this is the front, that's the back. So this is the Lexi notebook. <laughs> so I had to put my dog on there. It's like the cutest picture of her. And then I had to add Luca too. So this is a picture of him smelling roses. He actually was smelling the rose. <laughs> so again, this, if you imagine this is your front and that's your back. I've got a kitty notebook cover. As I said, these will be live soon. They're just in review stage. And then Ariel. So as you can see, her eyes, she's just so soulful. I love her so much. Oh, there she is. She's watching you. <laughs> so those, are, those three will be live soon. So I won't put those in the description box because they're not live yet. But once they are live, I'll add them to the, to the description box. But if you just search under my name, uh, Isabella Redwood on Amazon, everything should come up. Particularly if you click on me as the author, then everything that I've got should come up available at the time. So thanks so much for watching, take care and I'll see you in our next video. Bye for now.